A recent paper from the National Bureau of Economic Research has issued a warning that commercial real estate loan defaults could reach levels not seen since the Great Depression if interest rates stay high. This is a chilling prediction, especially when considering the potential ripple effects throughout the economy. The analysis, conducted by USC finance professor Erica Jang, points to several factors contributing to this precarious situation. Falling property cash flows, declining property values, and the challenges of refinancing are all causes for concern. In particular, three categories of real estate are under the microscope. Offices, multifamily households, and hotels. These are areas that have been particularly vulnerable in recent times, and the data suggests that this trend is set to continue. Currently, 15% of commercial loans are underwater, with a staggering 45% of office loans also in this predicament. Higher interest rates are a significant factor in all of this. They make refinancing more difficult, which in turn increases the risk of default. This is not just an academic exercise. Real-world consequences are already being felt. Economists are sounding the alarm about the commercial real estate industry, which has been hit hard by the pandemic and shifts in work and shopping habits. Falling property valuations and limited access to credit have exacerbated the situation. The banking industry is under stress, and potential regulatory scrutiny may tighten lending standards even further. Uncertainty in asset valuations and the possibility of a recession have led to a decline in deal activity. Office and retail properties are especially affected, with changes in demand and cash flow metrics. Throw in the potential for high inflation and a weakening economy, and you have the ingredients for stagflation, a scenario that could signal a return to the economic troubles of the past. The majority of economists are predicting a recession this year and believe inflation will remain above 4%. The recent banking industry meltdown could potentially lead to a credit crunch and slow down the economy even more. In summary, the commercial real estate market is at a crossroads. Rising interest rates, falling property values and refinancing challenges are creating a perfect storm that could lead to a wave of loan defaults. The effects of this could be far-reaching, impacting not just the real estate sector, but the broader economy as well. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to the Blueprint Boston on YouTube and follow us on social media to stay informed.